keyboard opening shortcuts instead of typing letters in Windows 10 or 11. Here are four ways you can fix it guys. If you are clapping your keyboard and it's opening shortcuts instead of typing letters, here are ways that you can fix it. So the method number one, sometimes sticky and filtery case can cause the problem if it's turned it on. So the only way to check if these keys are the real problem is to disable them. Click on the right menu, in the Windows menu, right here. Go on settings. And you can go on Easy of Access if you are using the Windows 10. If you are using the Windows 11, you can click on Accessibility. As I'm using the Windows 10, I'm going to click the Easy of Access. Right here, we are going to press the keyboard on the left corner. Inside of it, you are going to find Sticky Keys and Future Tabs. Turn off the buttons next to these tabs to disable both of these features. Right here, if you turn it on, click on off. And use the the keys. If it's turning on, click on off. So that was the method number one. The method number two is the next thing that, actu that you actually can do is disable the Windows Ink workspace. So press Windows plus R to open the run dialog box. And right here, register it and press OK. It will open the registry editor. Here you are going to look for the HK local machine. Click to expand. Now here you are going to look for the software. Click to expand. We are going to look for the policies. Click to expand. Now Microsoft. Click to expand. And here we are going to look for... Expand the Microsoft tab. Check... Expand the Microsoft tab. And here you are going to see if it's Windows Ink Space. If not, create it. To do it, we are going to click on the right button on Microsoft, click on New, and Dword 32 bit value. Right here, we are going to type Allow Windows Ink Space. Ink workspace actually, sorry. Double click on it and set it to zero. Then you can restart your computer. The method number three, the next thing you can do is run the keyboard troubleshooter. So launch the settings app in the Windows to do so. We are going to click on the Windows menu right here. Now type troubleshooter settings. Here we are going to look for additional troubleshooters and then we are going to look for the keyboard option. Click on it and then click on run the troubleshooter. The method number 4 is reinstall the keyboard drive. Another thing that you can do is restart the keyboard driver. Right click on the start menu and go on device manager right here. So, inside of it, we are going to look for the keyboard, to click to expand, and we are going to uninstall the device. Then restart your computer, your laptop, and it will automatically reinstall the driver. That's it guys, subscribe to our channel, thanks for watching, if it helped you, leave a like, if not, leave a comment in saying so, that I can know what is your problem and bring more solution to you guys. See you in the next video, and bye bye.